to my channel. If you've never been here before, special welcome to you. Today I'm coming to you with the Wet and Wild Pride Palette for 2022. Um, I went to Walgreens last night because I had to pick up something. Um, and I saw this and had to get it. And there is no red in it and I don't know why. So I was going to do an a rainbow look because I do a rainbow look every year but I'll just do that with a different palette so I'm just gonna put a look together with a couple of these colors I'm not sure how or what or anything but I think I'm gonna go with this really pretty shiny green this shimmery blue and then this black that if you look very closely it has a little bit of gold shimmer in it so hopefully that doesn't all end up as fallout even though it probably will um let me look for some brushes really quickly there's not one i want there's one that i can use for something um I should have looked for my brushes beforehand. I apologize. Here goes this one. And then this cup is full of brushes, so I'm having a little bit of trouble. Um, just trying to grab a few that might help me with this look. Um, let me grab this one and then one more if I can find it. There we go. Okay, so I'll let you know what brushes I'm using if they have a name or anything on them. So the first one I'm going to use is this BH Studio Pro 9. It's a flat um, brush, flat shading brush, I'm guessing. Um, I think think the first thing I'm going to go in with is this green on my lid because it's so reflective but we'll see what it looks like on the eye. I'm going to start out here a little bit because of there is some fallout with this but if you just blow it away it goes pretty quickly and easily. Um. This is a really dark green, really dark. Once you get the top layer down a little bit. So I'm just, and lately, unless I'm using a glitter, I don't use any type of base because I've actually found that my eye makeup will last better without one. I have, tried using it in all different kinds of ways and I have literally a bag full of different eye bases for a video I was gonna film but it never happened so um <clears throat> let me put my brush in the color switch I'm just gonna switch over to this blue and see what this looks like on this part of my eye. I want to use a couple different colors. So maybe I will actually use more than what I said I was going to. My dogs are going absolutely crazy. So if you hear them, I apologize. I only have one dog inside. The rest of them are outside. So... Hopefully she's not going too nuts. The male's probably here or something. Our male lady loves our dogs so much. She gives them treats every day. So they go literally batch crazy whenever she comes every day. So this is a... I don't remember what this is. This might be a Luxie pencil brush. It's some kind of pencil brush. Um, I'm gonna take um, a purple, the purple out of here, 
a purple. There's only one purple in here. And I'm just gonna kind of put it up above that a little bit. And then I'm just gonna get enough of it to put up above that and then I'm just gonna blend it in so I kind of like that that's actually pretty I didn't plan on this being a really long video or anything. I just wanted to really quickly use the Wet n Wild Pride palette because I try to get their collections every year when they come out with new things. Not their regular collections, but their special like limited edition things. Um, and not even like stuff like the Care Bears collection and the this collection and the that collection. I usually just try to get like if they come out with a pride palette and then I try to get all the Halloween releases um I don't know what it is with me and Halloween but I am a huge Halloween fan and I always try to get their Halloween palettes because they're so cute they have such cute names and I actually will use them except for the colors that are duds. I will use them throughout the year um, behind the scenes. So I'm gonna take this and just put it through my color switch really quickly. And then I'm gonna take a brush that's a little thicker. This is a e.l.f. Mint Melt eyeshadow brush. That's all it says. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to just stay within the purple that's already there. And I'm going to try to do little circles inside this. I hope it doesn't start washing it away. It's not. I just want to blend it a little bit because I would like it to look a little more seamless. It's a little bit patchy. So I'm just trying to get it to look a little more perfect. That's all. So there is that. All right. I'm going to put that through my color switch, but I don't think it's really going to do much because um, this started out being white and it's now blah, the color of my color switch. <laughs> um, okay. This is an LBE7 Lunar Beauty brush. I'm going to take this color right here and I'm going to put it on my brow bone and my inner corner it's not going on the most beautiful but it'll work I think maybe you might have to get through the top layer. It still has a ton of fallout, but I'll live. Um, I got some of this blue under my eye. So let me try to put some of this on my inner corner. So I do have like a little bit of a shimmer inside there. there is that so I think that is good I actually like I said I didn't want this to be a long video or anything and I figured it would be pretty quick 10 minutes or less so I'm just gonna throw on some mascara and then maybe a um a I color like a eyeliner yeah that's it sorry can't think 
actually I might even take the blue and the green that I used on my eye and just underline my eye with it. Let me touch that up and then let me see. Okay. Open. Okay, give me this blue on this pencil brush and That is just going to go on the first half of the eye. I'm going to put that in my color switch just for a second. And then we're going to go to that green. And then meet that in the outer corner. Perfect. What do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. It's a little heavy of a look, but not too bad at all. So I will have to do some more looks with this, especially next month when Pride Month actually starts. So um, let me know if you guys would like to see more looks from this palette. I would love to use it more. I would just like to pull in a, um, a red from another palette. That's all. So that is it. I will let you guys go. I appreciate and love each and every one of you, wherever you are, whatever time of day it is. I hope you're having a great one. I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.